Hello Sagittarius, thanks for being here. This is a general reading for anyone with prominent Sagittarius placement in your chart. I've included the description, links to the extended, and a link to my Etsy shop if you prefer a personal reading. Sagittarius, I heard one thing in meditation, and it was, um, it was, it felt very heartfelt. And I heard, I messed up and want to come back. So somebody is looking to return to someone they have split up from, have been apart from, um, messed up with. Uh, I don't know where this is going. So let's take a look at the energy and find out what you need to know for the month of February. Okay. <laughs> That's interesting. Forgiveness. Telepathy. You and another are connected in the spirit realm. Mm, okay, let's see what comes through for you, Sagittarius, for February 2023. I messed up and want to come back. Bottom of the deck. Detachment. Subtract your own agenda from the goal. Let go of the tight hold you have on this situation as there is a higher power at work. Okay, let's see where we go with this. Energetic cords. Disconnecting. Recovery. Twin soul. Boy, that's been coming out a lot. I don't know what's going on. Um, Interesting. Um, I'm getting an energy of someone who is releasing an unhealthy partner. That's what I'm hearing. Someone has disconnected or is severing ties. It's been, it's been I heard it's been a long road. Oh boy. Okay. Let's look at the energy surrounding this situation. Magician, sword, confidence in your magic. Okay, let's see where we go with this, Sagittarius. What is the energy surrounding this situation? Anything else? <laughs> it flew off the desk, but it landed on my computer. I'll get it. Ooh, a lot of energy in the deck. This one too, I'll grab that one. We have Sky Bridge, Possibility for Union. Hmm, I'll put that right there. Okay, let me grab this card. I have to reach in a weird spot. Okay. There's going to be maybe something that scares you, something explosive. I don't know. <laughs> Let's take a look at what came through. Repairing the veil. Forgiveness. Crown games. Right use of power. Hollow bone. Teachability. Eyes of the eagle. Rising above the fray. Deep diver. Diving into a task. Forgive the the noise and the interruption there, Sag. Um, all right, I, I will tell you the story that I'm getting. This is the tale of, I think, two relationships. Someone messed up a connection. Someone learned a lot from the connection uh, the hard way. I feel, um, Sagittarius, if you are remorseful for something that happened between you and someone else, you want to fix it. You're ready to put in effort. I have to tell you, I don't know if your person wants to stay. We're going to do this reading a little differently than normal. I'm going to look at the energy that surrounds um, the connection that is right now um, disconnecting. What is the energy surrounding you and your person? And then I'm going to look at your energy separately, you and them. 
just a little differently than normal, but I'm feeling guided to do that. Yeah, I'm hearing someone wanted to disconnect from something that became toxic. Oh my gosh. Really? Seriously, spirit? Okay, okay. Discovery. Uh-oh, something was found out. Let's see what we have here. Okay. The energy between you and the person you're disconnecting from. We have back and forth. A consciousness of lack. The healing light. New supportive connections. Hidden motivations. Okay. Yeah, I, I'm energetically and intuitively, I feel so strongly that this is... Uh, disconnecting from a relationship that became just um, perhaps convenient, easy. There might have been some reluctance to let it go because of money, but ultimately I think someone wants to heal and move on. You may not know that about your person, Sagittarius. I feel like there is something um, either that, you know, you're going to be discovering or it feels as though they, do, they don't want to tell you something. There may have been a hidden agenda in this connection. It's now being let go. I'm hearing the ship has sailed. Oh, gosh. Beneath that, we have the loving man decrease. Friends and colleagues could be relevant in its entirety or individually for you. Okay, Sagittarius, we're going to take a look at your energy. Um, all right, I'm guided to use the psychic tarot. First, your energy. What is going on in your energy, Sagittarius? And then we will compare you uh, with your person. Let's see if you are in agreement or feeling differently about this connection. So your energy in this connection. Memories of love, the Six of Cups. This could be a strong soulmate. It could be someone you have been with for a long time. It can be a reflection on the past. Okay, we have the base chakra, root chakra. Stand your ground. That's the Seven of Wands energy. We have the Seven of Swords energy and the Emperor. Um, I am getting somewhat of a stubborn energy with this Emperor. I'm also getting uh, that there, there's something that you wanted to accomplish in this connection. And maybe you didn't go about it the right way. Are you now making a decision, um, perhaps based on something you've learned or based on, okay, they're, they're pointing out the word envy. Is there another person now in the picture and, it, and you're, you're finding out your partner has withheld something? If this isn't you, could be. All right, I, I'm feeling there's one more energy for you that wants to come out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Three cards at a time. Spirit. Okay, I heard yes. All right, we have the moon in your energy. Um, throat chakra. Wanting to speak your truth. Needing to speak your truth. We have justice. The world, endings, and the devil. Ooh, Sagittarius, I don't feel that you're in a good place about this. I think that you may be realizing that um, something's out of whack. Again, if this isn't your energy, it's what you're feeling about what's going on around you. If this is your energy and this has um, taken a really negative turn, 
and you're in the devil energy, I feel like that could be feeling stuck. You don't know what to do. You know things are ending. Maybe you're trying to restore balance in the connection. I feel like perhaps you are, you know, fighting against something or you're, you're trying what you can try to restore this. And it doesn't mean that whatever's happened uh, has something to do with you. It, it doesn't mean that at all necessarily. Okay, I'll stop. Let's look at your person. Let's look at your person. How is your person, the person you are disconnecting from, feeling about this? How is your person feeling about your connection? King of Wands, Death, the Five of Cups, Five of Wands, Ace of Swords, Seven of Swords, bottom of the deck, Empress, wow. Sagittarius, this is really difficult energy. Um, your person is mustering the energy, I feel, to end this. Death, it, it's, it's done. Um, there's a lot of regret. There has been a lot of conflict. Um, now, it could be that you have butted heads with one another for one reason or another. You're both coming through with the need for truth, whether that is speaking your truth or, you know, kind of getting everything out on the table. Mm, I just heard no BS. So I don't know what is being discovered. You know, if this is, it didn't come out, but if this is an energy about finding something out, um, you know, at this point it could be either you or them who has discovered something, but you're both coming through with the Seven of Swords energy. And, uh, you know, oh, it's difficult because I feel like there is a hidden agenda, there's maybe um, unhealthy behaviors, even unhealthy, you know, tendencies within this connection, um, whether it is some sort of, you know, clinginess and imbalance, um, a lot of fighting and drama. It's the dynamic I'm seeing, unfortunately, is not healthy. Um, let's take a look at your person's truth, Sagittarius. What do they need to say to you? My heart has been broken. One thing after another has turned my life upside down. Bottom of the deck, they're about to leave. And I feel like you are saying, um, please, I messed up and I, I want to come back. Um, let's take a look at what spirit is advising you to do in this situation. What is it you should do to either mend this or let it go? I don't know what's going to come out. <laughs> Sagittarius, I'm so sorry. This is such a difficult energy. Draw on what you have experienced in the past for guidance in the present. Is this a repeat performance? Have you found yourself in this pattern or cycle with this person over and over again? Will history repeat itself? I just heard. Will history repeat itself? And if there has been a lot of conflict between the two of you, um, is this worth salvaging? 
We come into connection with our soulmates to learn and evolve. Someone cannot bypass their lesson. Could be you, could be them. I, I do feel that whatever has happened between the two of you, there is a feeling that I'm picking up from your person's energy that um, it's done. Something happening around you has greater persuasion than you may realize. Are you seeing it or turning a blind eye? Ooh, okay, I'm feeling another one. Advice for Sagittarius regarding this very challenging situation. I knew this was going to come out. I knew it. Sagittarius, it's time to let this go. To everything there is a season, a reason, a purpose. This, uh, it feels to me like there is drama. There's other people involved. There's something going on that um, is either showing you this has just been a karmic lesson that you've needed to learn with this person. It could be a cycle that no matter what you try to do to fix it, there's fear and challenges that this is, yeah, it's, it's over. It's not going to come back together. Oh my goodness. Wow. Let's get some advice for you. Pretty straightforward reading. I'm so sorry. I feel the challenging energy around this. It's heavy. They miss you. Reach out. Hmm. Why am I picking up something else? Advice for Sagittarius. What you've been through can only make you stronger. The worst is over. And enter, perhaps, someone else. A divine partner is on your path. This will be a love like you have never known before. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> um, Sagittarius, I think that the divine is guiding you to um, leave a situation behind. If this, I mean, I'm, I'm sort of feeling like I have to be honest, I'm picking up on you not wanting someone to let you go. Um, I feel like they have met someone. Okay, we're going to see what unfolds in the extended. This feels tangled. This feels really, <laughs> really messy. Oh my gosh. I'm going to extend it. So the link is below if you want to join me there. Um, Sag, tough energy, but we'll see where it goes. If you feel strongly, this is exactly what's happening in my life, in my story, the link is below. Thanks for being here. For those of you who choose not to follow me to the extended, I will see you mid-month. Take care.